What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Walls of CCLP4. We took on probably the most difficult level of the set <laughs> in the last video. So, in terms of difficulty, I think we'll be okay. I'm not sure. But I know that was a pretty hard level, so I think we're going to be alright for the most part. Anyway, this is uh, level 50, Brown Note. This one uses the walls of, uh, what's it called? Uh, Secret Underground Society, which, I'll be honest, uh, was a level from CCLP4 that I didn't actually expect to be make a good Walls of level, um, just based on the walls and the walls alone. I think the, uh, what's it called? I think the the blocks and such were removed. And which way do I go? Does it not? Does it, I don't think it matters, does it? Um. Yeah, they they were removed, so it's just the walls that were kept. And uses traps as an aesthetic. That's an interesting choice. I've never, I've never thought about using traps as an as an aesthetic for a level. Oh, I, I take that back. I have thought about it. I just never did it because I didn't think it would actually work right. Okay, there's a hint up there, but I don't, I don't know if I have to hold down any buttons for it to get to it or not. Okay, so I can go, go this way. This is kind of like uh, scouring the fire pit. Like it kind of connects with it in some ways. I don't think I need any of these blocks for anything. I think this is just a section to uh, collect some chips. Which is pretty cool. Okay, yeah. Somehow I, somehow I can go down there. Let's go this way. Oh. Oh, that's how you unlock this whole central thing. That was an audio glitch. Okay, so I can go this way. And this looks like to be the Paramecia room, which is still the Paramecia room. <laughs> Only two chips left. And the socket's right there. Let's see what else we got going here. I can go in there, but I'm not sure if I want to do that quite yet. So let's go up here. This looks like it's not really a strict order level, which I was expecting at first, but expectations... When it comes to Jeffrey's levels, expectations usually get blown out of the water fairly quick. Okay, this is a pretty interesting uh, extraction type thing. Okay, so I can do this. Okay. So somehow, somehow I can get two more. Wait, what? Can I? Yeah, I can do that. And then that. Right? Because I only need two, technically, don't I? I might have screwed up. Wait, I, I think I might have screwed this up. Because, yeah, if I push it, if I push this down, I don't have a way to, to retrieve it. Wait, do I? It's hard to tell with these traps. Okay, yeah. Alright, let's do this first, since I kind of know what, what the rest of the level consists of. Okay, I could have done that earlier. I don't think I did that before. Okay. So do this. Wait, push 
hold that down right there. Oh, wait. Wait, I did worse somehow. What? What? I'm, I'm, I'm confused. Okay, that goes there. That seems pretty logical. I don't see any any reason not to do something like that. Okay, and I, I can do that. So how did I only end up with one last time? Hmm. This is pretty tricky. Is it something like that? But then I can't, I don't have a way to get this out. Because it's stuck on the top thing. Okay, this is a little, this is a little weird. Do I do this? Maybe I have to do that first, and then I can do that, and then I can do this. So was that the, was that the trick? I just had to approach it a different way. I think that was it. I think that was it. That's kind of cool how that works. How it's that. Um. What? Wait. Then I have to have. Um. Yeah, I have to have six then. What is levels? I mean, seriously. This extraction puzzle is really weird. It's it's a good weird, though. Like, I don't see any other logical way that can be done. Okay, I can't push that left. So somehow I need four more blocks. Right? Oh. Ha ha, you, you got me. Sneaky little devil. <laughs> oh, really? There's a Sokoban here? A Sokoban in a trap aesthetic level? I don't know how I feel about that, really. Okay, I have to push that there. Yeah, I don't know how I feel about a, a Sokoban in a trap. I mean, I know where these traps are connected, of course. It's just, when you have to push blocks into traps, it's kind of, it's kind of weird to tell. Okay, I can do this fine. But now I only have four blocks for the Sokoban. Unless I can do that, which I can't. And I screwed that up, and then I screwed myself up. Okay, so now that I finally know how to do this puzzle, which was pretty cleverly hidden, and I am uh, thankful for there being no viruses on my PC. Thank you, McAfee, for the daily reminder. Except it's not a daily reminder. It's <laughs> if that was a daily thing, I wouldn't be a happy person. Nah, I'd still be a pretty happy person. Because knowing my PC is secure and... Well, I wouldn't call it secure, but... Um,
Okay, how then... I'm confused. How are you supposed to get through this? Like, pushing that down screws three blocks up. But pushing it all the way... Oh, I see. Okay. All right, that's where the that's this is where the silk man gets a little tricky. Sort of. Let me get that out of the way. Huh. I know this is an original Soka band, but wow. <laughs> okay, this is a. Let me see here. I think I see a way to do this. I think. I think I do. Wait, don't do it like that. Do it like this. So I think what I want to do... No, because that, that block's stuck right there. Okay, I better, I better not do that then. How do you do this, Soka Man? See, I remember JB saying something about a, a specific part of the level being not agreed with. I don't remember what it was exactly, but I that's all I just remember him saying some having some comment about this level, and I know it wasn't a not a wasn't a bad comment, but it wasn't a good one either. I don't remember what he said though. I'd have to do my history search on Discord to find out. How do you do this? This is so weird. I know that's like the thought process with the Soka Mans, but still. Okay. So what if I put that there? What what are the consequences? There's no consequences for doing that alone, but what if I just left it like that? I think the trick is I want to get two blocks right here and then I want to load the last three on that side. I think that's what the trick is. I'm, I'm not seeing the trick. I'm trying to like plan movements in, the, in my head or block positions in my head that will work. So if I put that block right there, this block right here, and push that to the left, these two are covered up and then there's these two right here. This one's stuck on the edge, so that cooks the level, because I can't push those, either of those farther. Okay, so that, that option's out. Pushing that left, and putting it, pushing it right, well, that doesn't do any good. Going around, pushing that down all the way, that, that still results in the same thing. So I think... I think this opening right here is the is the is the key. I'm inclined to believe that that is the that is the trick. But the thing is, I want to get this button held down. Like that that's if I get that held down, I can get this puzzle. Man, this is so weird. I'm glad I didn't play this in the last video, by the way. Like, I really wanted to, because I, I love brown colored aesthetics. Like, they're not used enough, I feel. And I really wanted to play it, but I'm glad I didn't. Because <laughs> I knew, this, I knew this, was, this wasn't going to take me no 10 minutes or anything like that. I wasn't expecting the Soka Man. I 
see, I gotta get this block out. I gotta get it down here, or at least in that spot right there. Like, that much I know. Or no, I can't even do that, because th that trap's right there. Unless that's one of the traps it connects to. No, it's all five. That would be a little bit mean if that was the case. I don't want to make any moves. Like, I don't want to mess this up. But it's like, I gotta try something. I just can't be standing around and doing nothing. Because that's not gonna do anyone any favors. Okay. I'm gonna crack this thing. I'm sure people that are watching this, especially Jeffrey, of course, they're, they probably know this solution and they're like, you know, it's like staring at them in the face, but me not so much. And I still have the rest of the level to beat, too. This is a Sokoban, guys. This is, this is, this is definitely a Sokoban. Okay, so what if I did? What if I did hold that, hold that down? Just out of curiosity, what can I do with that? Not much. And then holding that down doesn't do anything either. I feel like I'm on the right track, but I don't see any possible moves to solve this at this point. I, I'm inclined to believe I'm screwed. Because this block has to go right there, I, I assume. Like, that seems to be a pretty reliable option. But if I put these two blocks right here, how am I supposed to get one up there? Or better yet, how am I supposed to get them right here? Because I know this one's a trap button. I've been keeping that in the back, or I've been keeping that information in the back of my head. I feel like pushing a block right there was not a good idea. So I think that's what sealed my fate. <sighs> I can't push any of these out either. So this is all the room I have. Yeah, I, I don't know what to do here. I don't know. If I did that, what what good does that do me? I feel like that that's that's a good that's a good thing, whatever you want to call it. I feel like that's a good thing. It might not be, but I I feel like it is. Man, how? How do you do this? This is a little frustrating, really. I don't see any possible things to do. Like, if that, if these were floor and that wasn't a trap, I could see this the way this could work. But I, I think this is a screw. I'm going to make it the assumption that's a screw. Because I don't see any way to, to fix, I don't, I don't see any recovering from that. Which sucks, because I spent, like, 500 seconds just on that alone. So that's a little discouraging, but it's alright. I 
This is why I... I'm better at it now, but this is why I adapt Soko Band and not, uh... Um... Not make my own, because it, making my own, se all, they always seem trivial. Like, no matter what I do, but something like this, of course, is solvable. And this is the initial startup. Okay, I have to keep this in mind. This is how the thing starts. This is how it starts. So what do I do from here? So I'm forced to push this block to my left in the spots, and I'm I'm forced to do that as the as the starting point of the Soka Man. Okay, so. At least now I know this isn't a screw-up place. I feel like this is going to be a one-level video. I really hope it's not. This Silicon Man's taking up more than half of the video. That and the block extraction part. Okay, how on earth do you do this? Even with this initial starting... Point. I I still don't see a way that this is even done done. Like I have these two blocks right here in this formation already. Pushing the one above me to my spot right here is not going to help me either. It's actually going to screw me already. So this is a pretty easily screwed up, or not easily screwed up, it's an easily cookable Sokoban, from what I see. Man, how do you do this? This is really bothering me now. Like, seriously. Like, Okay, I do that. Yeah, that's good to know. And then where do I go from here now? Like, seriously, I feel like there's not enough room to make this work. I really don't want to open up Yask or whatever that program is, the Yetner Soka Man thing. I really don't want to have to open that up to solve this. Like, I, I'm trying to figure this out. I just don't see how it's done. Like, there's hardly any room for these blocks to move around in. Like, if this was a four block Soka, or a four block Soka ban, then this would be, you know pretty easy but of course it's five blocks so it's that's not the case this block up here is what's making this difficult by the way actually every block in this in this damn thing is making it difficult Like, okay, I can do that. I can do that, but what does that do? And I can do that, too. But I don't see what good that does. Like, I... I, I don't see what good that does. I mean, yeah, I can go around now, but now I can't even push a block right there. And all and all the blocks have to go through here. Well, that was a good idea. That was I felt like that went somewhere, but it it didn't. I didn't at least I didn't see a way that could work. <sighs> Why is this so difficult? 
this has to be like a late 100s level at least at least like a 110 or 120s level in the difficulty version I don't see this being any really I don't see that being anywhere early on I'm thankful I can at least go to the Sokoban first. Like the non-linearity of this is probably the is probably a well not probably it is a redeeming factor to, to this level. Okay, so do that, do that, do that, do that. Okay. Back into the starting point. What can I do? I seriously, I don't see this. I really don't. Usually by now I can see these Sokoban solutions. Or at least get somewhere, but I can't get anywhere with this. This is really irritating. And I would like for it to be in a good way, but it, honestly it's not. It's far from, actually. I can't push that down. I, I can push it down, but I can't recover. I can't fix it. So that's essentially a, a dumb move. If I can. I wish I can push this farther. I, I feel like there needs to be more room with this. Like, okay, I can go around and push this block down here. Okay, I can do that. And then I can push that block down. But that just seal that basically seals these four blocks up because any one of them is just gonna go down here, and that's not where where they are where, bleh, where they are supposed to go. So that's a bad idea. If I push this block right there. And I have a block, 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 block. Okay. But I'm on the wrong freaking side. So I can't do anything with that either. So what am I supposed to do? I don't know. I've been on this for almost 30 minutes already. Brown note is taking me longer than now until the moment you die. I did not see that coming. I expected... The, the the ladder to take a lot longer than this level. I haven't and I haven't even done the fire boot part. I haven't even done the fire boot part. That's how ridiculous this is. Like, okay, are you really supposed to do this? Just to clear my my curiosity, are you really supposed to do something like this? I hate you, Jeffrey. <laughs> oh my god. I can't believe that was actually the solution. The solution I thought wasn't was. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't have anything to say. <laughs> I'm just... <sighs> okay, well, that solution's done. Let's do this one now. This fire boot room. This actually looks pretty cool. So let's see what we got going here. I like the uh, the Paramecia on fire, by the way. Even in MS. That's only because it's not in the monster list. And I actually used that as an aesthetic choice 
for one of my walls of CCLP3 levels, which I released a while back. Okay, this is a pretty... I like this. This is cool. This is kind of like a... Um, flipper departments, in a way. Just with just with the fire boots. So fire boot department, which is kind of funny since there's actually fire departments in the real world. Okay, so what do I do? 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 What do, I do? I have six blocks... And I have six bombs, but I think... Where, where am I ultimately going with this, though? Like, I don't know where I'm actually going with the fire... With the fire... With the, bleh, the fi oh, there's... That's where I'm going. There's the chip right there. So, I do I need... Yeah, I do need all f six of them. Because I can't take blocks up through the actual fire. Okay, so I do actually need all these. I was thinking that might have been another subversion since clearly the Sokoban room wasn't... Well, this is probably going to be the only level in the in the in the video, guys. So, for the first time in, I don't even know how long, a one-level video. <laughs> I present to you half an hour later. Okay, I'm kind of lost on this on this next part. Oh, I think it's just this. Okay. Cuz now I can just do the same thing. Except I can just go around. You know, it's it's stuff like this that make me feel like I'm not like sometimes I know I'm a good level designer, and I don't want anyone thinking, oh, you know, Josh, you're feeling sorry for yourself again, blah blah blah. Wait, how do I do that? What? How do I get any of those out? Like, clearly pushing them... Clear, yeah, clearly pushing them in the traps is not a good idea. I need all three of those, by the way. I can't push blocks in the actual fire. I, I thought I could at first... But I, 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 I can't. So that means I must have screwed up somehow, even though I don't really see how. Like, do I really push one of those up on the edge? I don't think I... I wouldn't think I would, but maybe I actually do. Oh, well, let me restart. I, I don't think that was right. Okay. So those two seem to be okay. Oh, I think I... I think I see where I messed up at. There's there's a somewhat order to this that I didn't catch. At least, yeah. This middle pair of fire boots. Because, yeah. I need to get two of those out. Okay, that's pretty cool. This is a really... I have to say, this is a pretty solid level. Like...
Like, I don't know what JB complained about. I think, if I remember right, it was something about... Um, not being able to extract something on one side. It might have been the actual extraction puzzle. On, on the top half of the level. I don't know for sure, though. Okay, let's get this Sokoban done. I still can't believe that was the actual solution. Like, I didn't think it would actually work. Maybe that was me thinking too way too hard about it. I don't know. Really? I've done this like five times already. How did I... I think this is the part that JB was talking about. The thing is, I won't know for sure. Uh oh. Okay, now I'm just making dumb mistakes. I know how to solve every section. Now it's just a matter of actually doing it. So let's get this silica band done first, I guess. Okay, now I, I just have to actually remember how to do this. Yeah, because I didn't actually catch you can go around that part. Okay, yeah. <sighs> I, I, I like the Soko Band. I, I don't like how long it took me to figure it out, though. Two completely different things. Okay, let's just get the rest of the stuff. Oh. Still don't see a way to read the hint. But I'm probably not even going to try. Like, it's right there. But I already know what walls these are. I mean, it's pretty evident since I'm playing this version. Okay, let me go around real quick. Okay, go through here and get this chip and then we just gotta do the fire boot room. Man, I still can't believe how long this level took me. But I'm not going to make any cuts or do anything of that sort because why would I do that? The blind, the the full blind experience on my part at least has been shown. 
I think out of every room, though, I like this fire boot room the most. Okay, so I do grab that one next. And the only reason why is because it's... It kind of takes what Flipper Departments did and kind of elevated, elevated it to its own thing. And I think that's why I like it the most. Plus, I like the trick to to avoid the middle fire boot like that. I really hope I can do some kind of some justice with what I make for walls of CCLP3 because honestly, compared to what I've seen here or in walls of CCLP1 by JB and especially here, I feel like walls of CCLP3 is going to be a um not a failure of any kind, but more or less a um doesn't represent the level of quality that these two sets do. It's just a feeling I'm I'm experiencing personally. I I I feel like if I actually, you know, took my time, or well, I am taking my time, but if I actually like put effort into what to make every walls of level in CCLP3 into, I can make it pretty good. Like this set and walls of CCLP1. I think it's good so far. I think it's just because of the few amount of levels I have. I think that's how every set built when it's first constructed is like, but I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, hopefully with walls of CCLP3, I can do some 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 level of quality that this set and the other walls of set does. Because at the moment, it doesn't feel like it meets up to this kind of quality. But yeah, maybe that's just me. But anyway, that's Brown Note. That took me way too long to solve, thanks to that Sokoban. Uh, that is going to be... That's not going to get let down, is it? Anyway, this is a short level, but I, I'm not going to milk it just to complete another level. So we are going to play Hermopithesis. I don't know you you know you guys know I don't pronounce things right so whatever it is is this next level so uses the walls of ice and the blender which I don't see any walls from this point of view so we'll see how that goes but until then uh, thanks for watching everybody and we will see you next time